My name is Justin Kirsch. I'm the CEO and one of the founders of Access Business Technologies. We move mortgage companies to the cloud. We provide information technology infrastructure to over 500 mortgage companies, banks, and credit unions in the cloud today. For those of you that have worked with me, you know I'm passionate about our flagship product, MortgageWorkspace.com, because it's helping mortgage companies get to the cloud fast and realize all the benefits the cloud has to offer. One of the biggest challenges I'm gonna have today is actually getting through the Mortgage Workspace demo in eight minutes. So what I'm doing is I'm primarily focusing on the business intelligence aspect of Mortgage Workspace and using business intelligence inside of your mortgage, inside of your workspace. So as you're doing your work, all the way from a loan officer up to the, the CEO can see what's going on as they're working. So Mortgage Workspace does three things. It helps you manage, it helps you integrate, and it helps you me measure what matters most. So Mortgage Workspace manages and secures all of your software, all of your data, all of your devices, and Mortgage Workspace integrates your best of breed technologies like Encompass and Velocify, and all your back-end systems like accounting and human resources. And Mortgage Workspace helps analyze all of your data, like your pipeline, your funding, and providing you integrated reports and dashboards in real time while you're doing your work. So with all of that data and all of your systems, security is a super important part of what we're doing. And so what I want to emphasize today is when you log into Mortgage Workspace, that we use what's called two-factor authentication. And in today's world, it's like wearing your seatbelt. If you're not wearing it, you're gonna get into an accident. With all the phishing attacks that are happening, losing your password is a bad deal. And I wanna show you how it works. So once you log in, it pauses you before you actually log on to the system. And I'm gonna show you the screen on my, um, phone right now and it pops up. It's really simple to use. You click the approve button and then you're in the system and that's your second factor of authentication. And so as I clicked approve, now it's logging me into Mortgage Workspace and here we go. So depending on who I am and the role that I play in my organization, this dashboard is built automatically for me and it gives me access to all the tools that I need to do my job. It completely integrates with Office 365 and your email system and all the apps that you need to do your work. So I'm logged in right now as the CEO of a mortgage bank and it's showing me right underneath my toolbar, my dashboard and all the things that matter the most to me. I wanna see all the month to date loans that I've funded. I wanna see them in units and I wanna see which regions are, are beating which regions and I can scroll up and even see my top branches. I can even get a view of my pipeline and how long loans have been in a particular stage of the pipeline. And I can drill down on any of this all the way to the detail level very quickly, which I'll show you in a second. So besides that, if I logged on as a loan officer, the loan officer will actually see their portfolio and what's going on for them and what matters most to them. So the important part of this is the system understands who you are, the role that you play in the organization, and what's important to you and what should be important to you if you don't understand it. So you can also get to all of your other apps in here, not just Mortgage BI, but any app that you want and you've already authenticated in a really secure way. So your, your username and password is done one time, you get into all of your apps all at once. You can change this depending on what group or team that you belong to as well. So what I'm gonna do is drill down on um, the business intelligence aspect of things and show you guys, I can go from a loan level really quickly and then drill down. This is a, a great report that shows you by branch how many, who's in the lead. So this is a year to date report that I can quickly see based on purchase, based on refinance, all the loans that I got going on and I can easily drill down onto it and I can pick a branch and look at it and filter it. I could pick an account executive that's over these branches or I can even look at my top loan officers and who they are across the whole company. If I wanna look at the loan officers inside of a particular branch 
It's very easy to do. I can just expand to the next level like you would in a, in a pivot table. And then those loan officers show up right underneath. As I click on one, all of the statistics show up for that particular loan officer that I'm looking at. So now what I want to do is show you how to get to a scorecard which a loan officer would use to keep track of what they're doing and how well integrated this is. <clears throat> so I've got a loan officer here who's done pretty well. It shows he's been with us for about four years. And in a lifetime, he's done 151 million in loans. He's been my top loan officer now for three years running. I can see that right up here. He set a goal for himself of five million uh, this month and he's already beat it by 8%. Last month he did the same thing by 1%. So what I wanna do now is show that I can drill down at a detailed level with these loans. And I'm looking at my active pipeline and I can look at a few different views of my active pipeline, including the stages they're at, all from one place. And when I click on it, everything filters. And I've got a couple of loans that are about to expire. And so I wanna look at those and see what's happening. So I can come down and actually look at the loan detail that automatically filtered for me down here and all the different people that are working on this loan. And let's say I want to keep this loan from falling off, so I want to see who's associated with this loan and I want to call a meeting right away to deal with those issues with that loan. I can click start meeting and it's aware of all of the folks inside that and it shows a picture of my um, system and I can start a meeting right from within Mortgage Workspace, which I'm gonna do right now. And then I'll pick the people that I want in my meeting and it's gonna start dialing them up. Hi Justin, how's it going, what's up? It's going great guys, I got a problem with my loan that I wanna show you guys. Let's take a look. So now you guys can see the hey. screen here. Hey! So which one of you guys is holding this loan up? I want to get it going. I've got uh, two days, uh, one day before this lock expires. Can you see my screen here and pull this up? Yep, yep I see yep. it. Let me turn that down a second. <laughs> All right, thanks for joining, guys, and thanks for... Um, taking a look at this. We'd love to have you stop by our booth and drill into a little more detail. But um, if you build your mortgage intelligence right into your system as you're working, it's way more effective than if it's sitting outside as a separate system. And that's what Mortgage Workspace does. Thanks.